In this video, I will show you how to add the reference for a book. First, create a new collection to classify and save your references. So, if you're using Zotero to write your dissertation, then you might want to label this as dissertation. You can also create a new collection for the exams of different modules to keep your references organized. The next step is to add references. I am going to show you how to do this manually and without writing a single word for books. To add references manually, click the green button. Here, you have different items such as books, journal articles, newspaper articles, and you have even more options here. Let's click on book. On your right hand side, you can see that there are many fields that need to be filled out to create your reference, but you don't need all of them. Double check what referencing style you are going to use. Easy tip. You can go to your university's website to see what fields need to be filled out for the style that you are required to use. Let's say that you are using the Harvard style. So, for books, you need the author's surname, their initials, the year of publication, book title, place of publication, and the publisher. Where do we find this information? One source can be the actual physical book, your university's library, or Google Books. Here you have all the information you need. First, let's add the title of the book, then the editors. You can do this by changing this from author to editor, although the Harvard style asks for the initials of the editor's name, you can write their full name. It's better to write the full name here because some referencing styles might ask you for the full name. When you tell Zotero that you want to use the Harvard style, it will automatically write the initials for you in the reference list. How to automatically add the references for books? You can do this automatically by importing a citation. You have this option in Google Books just click on RefMan and download the file. Before clicking on it, make sure you are in the correct collection you've created and tick Import into a new collection and click OK. You will see that the reference for the book has been added. It's always good to double check that all the information that is being asked is there. For instance, we can see that the place of publication is missing just fill it out and voila! Another way of doing this is by using the International Standard Book Number, ISBN, which can be found inside the physical book, your university's library or Google Books. To do this, click on Add Items by Identifier and copy-paste the ISBN. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe for more BZ tips.